Yo, what is up guys, Mamba Gang, Mamba Army, Laker fans, Kobe fans, basketball fans, and just everyone around the world, man. Welcome, welcome, welcome for another video. If you are new here, man, welcome to my channel. I made this channel to show you guys my love for Kobe, my love for sneakers, uh, but especially, especially share the Mamba mentality message with you guys. I believe that even though Kobe's not physically here, um, he still inspires a lot of us, man. He still inspires us with the leadership that he had, the hard work that he put in, um, that Mamba mentality, man, being the best version of yourself each and every day, just getting better, practicing your craft. You know what I mean? Taking risks, all of that good stuff, man. So welcome to my channel, man. If you are a returning viewer, man, I appreciate the support. As you guys already know, I do have an Instagram and a TikTok as well. Instagram is mambakicks.la. All that information is going to be down below in the description. Um, and my TikTok is mambakicks.la, um, just as is. Uh, but yeah, man, let's get into the video. Today, I wanted to give you guys a little first up look, uh, maybe some sizing information on the crew neck that was released uh, on Kobe's birthday a couple of weeks ago on the 23rd of last month. So. I just got it in uh, yesterday and I just wanted to give you guys, you know, how it looks. Yeah, man, let's check it out. Before that, I wanted to see if it was still on sale or not on sale, but still in stock on the website. So let's check it out. So as you guys can see, I am already on the Mamba, Mamba Sita website, Sports Foundation website. Um, so this is a crew neck that I was telling you about. I guess it's the Mamba and Mamba Sita reflective logo sweatshirt, which is a crew neck not a hoodie um so it is on in stock in a medium and a large uh i'm gonna warn you guys right now it is kind of on the pricey side 180 dollars you know plus the tax and shipping comes to you know closer to 200 so be aware of that man i did mention that uh, when i actually got this in my last couple of videos i mentioned the price so they do have it in stock in those two sizes i believe that all, there is also a crop top and a kids, uh, let me go back. I believe there's a crop top version for girls or women. Um, yeah, which is that one. But that one, unfortunately, is out of stock, if you see there. And then the kids, which is a smaller sizes, it is out of stock as well. So, uh, yeah, man, let's check it out, man. Uh, let's see how it looks. Let's see how it looks on me. Let's check out the quality, and we'll take it from there. All right, you guys, so here you have it. Um, I was kind of eager to open it up, making sure everything was good and legit. And yeah, man, so here it is. It actually came in one of those kind of like USPS uh, bought, uh, bags. And then inside of that bag, it came, it comes in here. So uh, let's check it out. It does, this is pretty nice actually. It's like a little Ziploc type of little bag, plastic bag with the Mamba, Mamba Sita logo in the front. Force Foundation, Mamba Mamba Sita right here at the bottom. And in the back it says, Mamba and Mamba Sita are trademarks of Kobe Inc. Uh, and just a couple of, I guess, warning uh, messages down here. This bag is not a toy, blah, blah, so nothing special. Uh, let's check it out, man. I Like I said, I already opened it. Give me one sec, let me get this out. Okay, guys, so here you have it. So as you can see, it does come with that play, hashtag play Gigi's way. Uh, red um, What is it like wristband? I believe some of these were in the last hoodie that they released as well It says GG Bryant with the heart Mamba Sita 5106 Hashtag play Gigi's way That's about it. So that's pretty much, you know, um, kind of representing G Gigi um, yeah, and then um, they have this little card. Let's see what it reads. So it says Mamba Mama Cedar Sports Foundation. Thank you for supporting our foundation and for furthering Kobe and Gianna's legacy. Uh, I guess there's some care, care instructions. So due to special screen printing, do not machine dry with heat. Machine wash cold inside out on delicate cycle. Hang slash air dry only. As a special gift, we've also included a red blaze bracelet that is only given to friends who support the foundation. We encourage you to wear our Mamba Mamba Sita Sports Foundation gear on social. Please tag uh, Mamba Sita Sports, Mamba Mamba Sita Sports, play Gigi's way. So there you have that. 
So let's check out the Krunik itself now. So as you guys saw by the pictures online, it is all black. Let me take get rid of this paper. Oh, this is nice. They included the little paper that's usually on some like shirts. You guys see, and it does have that Mamba, Mamba Sita print on there. Pretty nice. It's pretty cool. Okay, aside from that, I'm doing this with one hand, but I wanted to show you guys. I'll probably put the camera down in just a bit. I'm just gonna gonna give you guys a close up real quick, so how it looks. So it is just your regular basic crew neck. Um, it doesn't feel too thick, but it doesn't feel too thin, if that makes sense. I think I felt like those champion sweaters a little bit thinner. Those, you know, ones, the, the ones that you kind of get at Walmart and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, man, I mean, it is all just black. Um, the right sleeve doesn't have any print on it. It looks like it's just all black right in the middle. It has that reflective. So if you guys can see, it is that reflective, shiny. It almost reminds me of that like patent leather they use like on your Jordan Bread 11s. Um, yeah, that's kind of what it reminds me. So be aware of that. I'm, I'm guessing, you know, that's probably why it has those care instructions on that card, just to make sure you don't mess this part up. So it does have their logo right in the middle. Let me see if I can kind of expand this real quick. And give you guys a better view here. So it does have their um, logo right in the middle. I don't know if you can see because of how dark it is, but right below it, it does say Mamba. Uh, let me see if I can get a better view here. So it does say Mamba and Mamba Sita. There you go. If you can see it there. Mamba and Mamba Sita. So that's all it says. It doesn't say Sports Foundation. It just says Mamba and Mamba Sita with their logo right in the middle. So I noticed just now as well that on the left sleeve, it does have that Mamba Sports Foundation logo as well right here. So I'm sure you guys can see that right there. So nothing too crazy. It does come with this tag right here. Mamba Mamba Seed our trainer said Kobe. And again with that just that. So the tag inside this read Mamba and Mamba Sita right there as well. So let's see if there's anything on there. Nope. So yeah, man, I did go with the large. I'm surprised it doesn't have the sizing on here. There's one thing I just noticed, it doesn't have the sizing. It doesn't have the sizing in here. Oh, okay, maybe this has a sizing. This has the care instructions. So another one of that. Not even the hat has a sizing. So, I mean, I'm just going to go and say this is a large. <laughs> That's the only information that I have for my order that this is a large. It doesn't say that it's a large anywhere around here. But this is a large, you guys, in case you guys are wondering. I did order a large. I just don't see... Unless I'm missing it somewhere, but oh, okay. So right here was hidden. This is a large. I figure sometimes they do put it to the side. So it is a large. I'm going to put this on, show you guys how it looks on me. I am around 5'10", about 180 pounds, kind of like on the thinner side though. Um, thinner, uh, how should I say it? Thinner, chubby side, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, let me throw this on, show you guys on camera how it looks on me. If you guys are interested in purchasing it, purchasing this still, I will leave a link down in the description uh, as well. And yeah, we'll finish off the video in just a bit. See you guys in a bit. All right, you guys. So I do not know if you're able to tell, but this is how it looks on me. There is no pockets on the sweater as well. I forgot to mention that. Um, like I said, I'm about 5'10". 5'11-ish, um, you know, kind of on the skinny, but little gut type of figure. And uh, to be honest, this fits me a little bit loose. It has like that baggy, oversized fit to it. Um, I'm used to getting larges like in Nike crew necks, Nike hoodies, 
Um, and this fits a little bit bigger than that. I can tell, I don't know if you guys can feel it or see it, I mean, but this is how it fits. So, yeah, so I don't mind it though. I feel like it actually fits okay. Like, especially when winter come in, you like that more loose, especially I feel like that loose um, trend um, style is coming back and I feel like this would be perfect, man. So this is something you just kind of throw on real quick. I liked it. Um, I'm just hoping, the only thing that's kind of worrying me is that if I wash it accidentally the wrong way, and it's gonna get messed up. I hope not, but you don't knock on wood. But yeah, man, here you go. That's how it looks on me. A little bit baggy. You know? This is cool. This is probably something that I'm gonna wear quite a bit, man. I'm gonna be honest. I think it's just all black, um, you know, matches everything, pretty simple. And then you also get to represent, you know, Kobe, Gigi, the Mama Sports Academy and stuff like that. So yeah, man, there you guys have it. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. I'll be happy to answer any questions you guys have, but this does fit. If you like it a little bit more snug, I say, size down on this so if you're large and you like it a little bit more fit go with the medium but i don't mind it i think it's fine especially right now i'm kind of trying to go on a little bulking phase so i hope that i can maybe you know fill it in a little bit more but with that being said man let me know how you guys feel about this i know to a lot of you it's not going to be worth 180 dollars i understand i trust me i understand it's not meant for everyone um, you can find cheaper, maybe alternatives or some of those little, um, you know, there's a lot of Instagram posts or people selling like their own uh, merchandise, you know, Kobe merchandise. So, you know, if this is not for you, man, I totally understand. Um, I'm, to be honest, I'm not even quite sure what brand uh, made this. You know what I mean? I know the, the Mamba and Mamba Cita Sports Academy actually was uh, with Nike brand on some of the stuff. But yeah, this has no Nike logo, no, no, none of that. So yeah, man, let me know how you guys feel, man. With that being said, thank you guys once again, man. Please stay safe out there, man. And it has been really hot here in California. Drink a lot of water, stay cool, man. Do your, do your thing to stay healthy and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. All right, you guys, I did want to mention two things um, that I noticed when I had it on. The first thing is that it is very warm. Um, like I said, it doesn't feel like it's too thick, heavy cotton, but it is not your like, your very light, thin uh, material either. So that is one thing. Another thing I did want to mention that I feel is kind of important is when I had it on, it felt like it was really, um, and you guys can see right there, it attracts a lot of like, uh, how, how do I say it? Like not dust, but put it this way. If you wear this around your cat, your dog that sheds a lot of hair or anywhere that's kind of dusty or a lot of dirt and stuff like that, um, this, it looks like it attracts and it will stick onto the sweater pretty well. So as you guys can see, like just by me wearing it, um, for the last you know 10 minutes or so making you guys this video i can see already that it attracts a lot of like this weird um i don't know maybe dust particles i don't know what you want to call that but i'm sure you guys can see them right there um so yeah that's one thing i've noticed um i don't know if it's just because of the type of cotton this is made out of or what but yeah just to give you guys a heads up because i feel like that was pretty important it looks um you know it kind of gives you like an ashy type of look because of that so yeah man um 
but yeah with that being said um i'm gonna finish it there man um don't forget to obviously wear your mamba cedar shoes with this sweater and represent um perfect combination right there in my opinion um but yeah man let me know how you guys felt about that uh, like i said oversized baggy type of fit it does seem to attract a lot of like these little type of hairs that you see kind of like flying around in your house or you know uh you know what i mean but uh, aside from that i mean i think it's just a plain kind of dope you know little sweater to kind of wear or a crew neck to wear kind of like on the you know just here and there um it is on the price pricey side so be aware of that and uh yeah man that's all i got for you guys today once again thank you guys for watching uh more content coming soon i still have not heard anything about nike releasing releasing any kobe's in the upcoming future but um yeah man make sure you follow me on instagram and um my uh tiktok man i will be I, right there is probably going to be daily videos daily stories um daily type of content aside from youtube um so yeah make sure you follow me on those platforms because i'm going to be showing more on feet you know uh what you know on feet pictures of what i'm wearing uh stuff like that on there so once again man appreciate every one of you guys stay safe out there until next time peace Dance.